What is going on everybody? We've all seen 3D movies and I don't know if you guys knew or not, but YouTube is starting to do it now. One of the best 3D creators is named Tompo. He's done awesome stuff like Super Mario Brothers and swinging a machete and now he wants new ideas for his new video. What I'd love to see in 3D personally, you guys all know I love drifting, I love cars. I would love to see some 3D drifting uh, gameplay maybe, some really nice wall taps, some wall hugs, some tandems. That would be crazy insane i'd love to see that so check out tompo leave a comment click on the link right here and submit your own 3d request and do not forget to subscribe thank you guys very much don't bring me back What is going on, everybody? It's your boy Slap Train, and today we're bringing you guys another episode of Forza Horizon Supercar Cruising. And today we have something special from the new March Car Pack. It is the Nissan R390. This thing's an absolute monster. Has almost 1,100 horsepower and weighs a little over 2,000 pounds. So this thing is an absolute beast. This is what the car looks like here. Very nice looking car. It's a little bit damaged up. That's how I bought it. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, so let's get this thing driving. We're gonna go look for some other cars to drive. Hopefully uh, have some decent challenges and maybe let this thing loose and see how fast this thing can really get. Okay, so on the dirt, it's not the greatest, obviously, with any car. Let's get this thing back on the road here. And I am using my paddle shifters. I'm not an automatic transmission, sir. So whoever commented on a few other my videos saying, Hey, what? Why are you an automatic stop train? I'm not. I am doing paddle shifting, good sirs, all right? So, let's see uh, what's going on in here. Now, right away, the handling isn't as good as, say, like, the Maserati or anything like that. Um, but, I think, when I get used to it, though, in terms of the braking and in terms of the corner, I think this thing's going to be a real nice car. Um, I think, though, I maybe should have put back in the weight. I'm not 100% sure on that, though, but we'll have to wait and see. See, like, look at that. As soon as I put my foot down a little bit, I know I'm only in second gear, but um, this thing is just wanting to get tail happy, like crazy. And uh, for these little sections here, it's probably not the greatest for this car. Uh, let's see where I want to go. Let's see who that is on the right. Oh! Oh, that looks like another supercar. Come here, good sir. Who are you? Oh, damn, brown. Okay, I'll, 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 I'll drive the same lean at seven. I'll take care of it. Woo! Look at that, man. It, it gets right away from you as soon as you let that foot down. Oh, you fucking bastard. Oh, we drifting right now. We drifting, we drifting. Excuse me, good sir. Oh, what? No. I meant to look back. Where is this guy? Holy shit, he's right behind me. Let's get traction, man. That's all I'm asking for is traction right now. Sorry, sorry. Can't even get traction right now. Whew, this thing has problems. We tried, oh, fucking dirt road now, too, for this thing. Beautiful. Oh, Jesus. Oh, help me, Jesus. All right, so this thing is literally a handful to drive with the wheel. Um, literally have to be driving with like my foot arched on the pedal, not even fully accelerated to even get any sort of traction. The turning, I'm not a big fan of the turning on this car. Um, I think this thing, if it had the rear spoiler, I think it'd be really nice in terms of handling and a nice mixture of speed. Um, but I mean, really, this thing is just, with with my wheel, at least with the settings that I'm on, this thing is a fucking handful. Like, look at this, man. It just fucking spun out on me. Now, I did see a discount sign there. I'm not going to worry about it. But, uh, yeah, this thing is just, I know it doesn't help that I'm on dirt, because obviously this is not a fucking dirt car. But, uh, I mean, turning radius is, is like a tank. This is really what I feel like on the car. You guys may may disagree with me, and that's completely fine. I'm going to get the fuck out of this dirt, though, because I'm getting pissed off. I got a massive route to go. So let's go down the hill with this thing. 
see how it drives down the hill. Um, I'm curious, to be honest, because I think... I don't really know. I think it'll do okay. Let me get my chicken fingers in. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I think it'll do okay on the hill. But I really have to be throttle careful, though. Like, I can't just let it go whenever I want. Because really, this thing is... I mean, I can kind of feel it a little bit better now on the pavement, but still, it grips. It, it, it takes a while for the tires to re, to just to just regain the grip, right? So, I mean, whenever... Holy shit, three Ferraris? Oh, fuck. Yeah, it takes me a while to regain the grip on the car. Like, even in fourth gear, man, the tires just want to come out. This thing is just a pure speed machine. I'm wondering... I'm curious to see how it's going to do on, like, the highway situation. I'm not happy with the braking. I really am not. I'm not happy with the cornering on this car. Um, I don't know if it's just bad driving on my part, but I think this thing's like a fucking brick. Like, whoever's in front of me there, I can't even catch him because I can't even get my foot to the floor. There's too much horsepower in this thing really to do anything. Done 4 GT, I'll drive it down the hill. Come here, bitch! Alright, let's do it! Oh, this guy wants to go me. Excuse me, sir! Holy shit! Come on, man! This thing takes a while, man, to really get going. I think if I'm just careful on the throttle, I think the car is fine. But really, once you let it go, though, it's kind of like you need to be on a flat pavement or something really straight to really just to just open up the throttle. I mean, this thing is just crazy right now. I think though, if this thing was all-wheel drive, this thing would be a mo what the fuck is that guy doing? Guy's dead. Um, yeah. So I mean, really. Oh shit. Do a little bit of sliding with it. But yeah, I'm. I'm honestly. I mean, I'm not too impressed with the car. It's not as fun to drive as some of the other supercars that I've driven already. But um, I mean. The difficulty factor on this car, I'd probably say, is about a, about a 9 out of 10. Um, I mean, like, you guys may, like, disagree with me, and that's fine, but for me personally, that's how I feel about the car. Um, it's very hard to let go of the full throttle and just really put your foot down. There's no traction, and that's probably my fault in terms of doing the weight reduction, and that's fine, right? So, I mean, I don't care if it's my fault, but, um, yeah, I mean, this thing, let's see how this thing does on the highway, and then I'll give my final review on it. Fourth gear, we're gripping. I think we're good now. We're getting out of four, fifth gear at about uh, 226 out of fifth gear. Let's see what I can top this sucker out on. Holy shit, man! This is crazy. 256, it looks like. I'm going to see if I can shift into seven. I doubt it, but we'll see. No seven. Damn, I am sorry, PT Cruiser. Oh, what? I didn't even touch that fuck. Oh my god, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit! Alright, so that was uh, pretty crazy. This car, though, is very, very tough to drive. As I said, it's, it's something that you can't really let the throttle go. Um, unless you are 100% certain that it's a complete straight line ahead of you and you have a good grip on the wheel. I mean, that's how I feel with the, with the car itself. I mean, as I said, um, I am on full force feedback. I'm on full dampering, full springs, everything. So this thing really grips, and um, it really grips my wheel hard. So, I mean, it's really hard to get traction with this thing when the wheel is consistently going everywhere. But other than that, the car is nice when it gets going. Um, I think if you were able to put back in the weight, I think the car would be really nice. And I'd like you guys to try it out. Let me know how it is with the weight back in it for the guys that do have a wheel. And for the guys that have a controller, let me know how it is with just the controller too. So, 
that's about it for this episode, guys. Thank you guys very much for watching. It's your boy Slap Train. Until next one, I'm out. Peace. Don't bring me down.